Travis, I want this to be the last time you ever ask this question <laughs> to anyone. I think we've asked it in your in we've your entire life. I don't want I don't want to see you asking this question in any other SEO group for looking for an answer. Um, They're long both long story short, it doesn't matter. It yeah. it does not matter and, unless you unless you really need. Uh, the paid option, like one of some of the Yoast paid options, which most people don't need. Um, so, so Rank Math I think offers a bunch of the stuff for free. I, I haven't looked at Rank Math in a while now, um, but at the the reason they got so popular is they were basically giving away for free the stuff that the other ones were uh, you had to pay for. Uh, but ninety nine percent of people do not need those paid options. And so literally any of the SEO plugins uh, would be all right for you. I always give a disclaimer about Rank Math too. Um, Rank Math is the only one I ever see uh, negative stuff about really. Hmm. Um, you know, like in groups and well, stuff. Well, like years ago, Yoast had this one pro that had the problem the where image problem. Yeah, basically they uh, they updated the plugin, they did something wrong, and a bunch of people lost rankings, um, and then they corrected it, and mm -hmm. the rankings went back. Um, other than that, Yoast has kind of been like the tried and true. I personally use Yoast on basically everything, um, but yeah, I, I rank math is the only one that I ever see negative stuff now, and it's also like the most hyped one. I, I I feel like people buy into the marketing too much on it, and they people always want the most technical, you know, um, advanced thing to use. Which I guess you know, if you're getting extra bells and whistles, that's cool. But I've net like I've used Yoast since I got started in SEO. It's what I'm comfortable with, and so that's why I stick to it. But I do have rank math running on a couple websites. Um, I've never had to go in and change anything um, really on either of them. Yoast, we had that image indexation issue that happened that one time and uh, really outside of that, I can't think of too much that's ever given me problems with, uh, yeah. with either of them, honestly. But I mean, if, um, I was gonna, if I was gonna I give you advice, I would just say go with Yoast because rank math, um, you know, there's, I've just, I've seen too much chatter of like, stuff that's kind of like unknown like basically are they you know are they selling data are they or you know or people have complained about uh it like basically tanking their rankings or two but i don't i don't read too much into the stuff because at the end of the day the choice of plugin doesn't matter unless it's messing up right they, they do very simple things or what you should be using them for are very simple things which is just changing your your titles and your metas and stuff like that. Um, yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't really be using them for much more other than like, you know, setting some kind of pretty basic on page stuff and, you know, generating your site map and stuff like that. I've actually got an article on this as well. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. Don't we have a Yoast versus Rank Math? We do not. Um, maybe it's a YouTube video from this was one actually of our one of the ones. first articles I wrote for the site like a really really long time ago. Um, but yeah, I would just kind of go into our reasoning here a little bit more and um, you know, basically what they offer, what they don't offer, uh, stuff like that, and and then I take a very long time to explain that your choice of plugin does not matter. <laughs> You're not going to rank better because you pick one of these than than the other one right just get it pick one get it over with and then stick to the fundamentals you know solid on page solid content solid link building um this is just like what color shoelaces you're wearing pretty much yeah <laughs> no, they, we've done this question a couple times all right Let's see who's next never again travis never again just pick one. Pick which one you think has the coolest logo. Yeah. Hey everybody, thanks for watching. Be sure to check the description below for links to our blog for more info on this topic, along with a bunch of other cool stuff like case studies, our Facebook community, and our link building services. And like always, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell if you enjoyed the video. Thanks and happy ranking.